Hey guys, I am in Chuanzhou train station. Breakfast of champions. And I'm super excited because today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a day trip. I am going to Fuzhou which is a city not too far away. It's about an hour on the train and apparently 39 hours to walk there if anyone was interested. I've never been there before. I've always wanted to, so super, super pumped for it. But uh, one interesting thing I did find today as I was getting dressed, I was like, what kind of weather should I dress for today? I look at the weather and it, the top temperature today in Chuanzhou is 21 degrees. And Fuzhou, which is just an hour away by train, it's 12 degrees maximum. Like, how is that possible? 10 degree temperature change. Okay, we have arrived in Fuzhou. Woohoo! Oh, it is cold. It's really cold. <laughs> One thing I failed to mention is that Fuzhou isn't just any city in Fujian province, it's actually the capital city. What a funny ad. Okay, so in such a big city like Fuzhou, of course, I need a local guide. So I have two friends here. Hi, guys. Yo, what's up? Do you want to introduce yourselves? Yeah, so basically, uh, I'm Aaron. Uh, my YouTube channel is Travel with Teal. I've been living in China for like three, four years. And uh, this is my best friend, Shady. Shady. Hey guys, I'm Shady. <laughs> I'm Shady! <laughs> and uh, my friend just call me Strong Shady, but I haven't got a YouTube channel yet. <laughs> yeah, next year. Okay. I'm sure we're all eagerly awaiting your YouTube channel. <laughs> just basically, we're gonna show uh, Amy around Fujo. Keen as a bean, let's head, yeah, let's let's head go. to our first let's stop. Go. Okay, right. wait. Uh, wait. That coffee looks good though, so I want a coffee okay, first. Okay, first stop coffee. <laughs> I have a question. I've been in big cities for too long. Does Fujo only have two subway lines? Yeah, so far, yes. <laughs> and it took eight years to build that one. Yeah. The red line. I'm so used to being in big cities and seeing like a spider web yeah, of maps yeah, yeah. and it's like, oh my god, so cute. Two lines. Yeah. Hey Shady. Do you have a do you have a style icon? Uh yeah. Look into the mirror. In <laughs> Okay, first stop for today, Aaron and Shady have brought me to Ding Di Shan, which is essentially this mountain in the middle of Fuzhou city. But the best part about Ding Di Shan, in my opinion, is this awesome red bridge here that gives you the most amazing panoramic view over Fuzhou city center on both sides. Like, cool. <laughs> so Fuzhou is surrounded by mountains so when there's like hurricanes and typhoons and stuff we're like quite protected. In the summer we get like a typhoon every like two weeks and I live on the 40th floor right so I'm going for a toilet and the whole building's just like this on the city. So I'm sat down and I'm like hey hang on a minute what's going on. Now we're going to the city centre. But yeah let's go let's keep going on this let's adventure. Let's go should we do one of those cool <laughs> little <laughs> vlogger type effects? I'll see you in the center of Fuzhou. Wow! Now we're here. Look as at if that. by magic. <laughs> um, this is called San Fan Shishan. It's basically three lanes and seven alleys. So it's one of the most famous streets here in Fuzhou. And it's basically loads of little small alleyways um, that lead off to cafes, bars, shops, stuff like that. Well, so yeah. It sounds very cinematic. So I think it's time for you to show me what you've got because. Aaron here is actually the king of B-roll. He shoots the most amazing cinematic footage. So, you know what? Let's see you do your thing. What's your favorite thing about living in Fuzhou? Um, my favorite thing about living in Fuzhou is the food oh. because the food is so nice and I love spicy food. So if you like spicy food, you need to come to Fuzhou. I was always under the impression that Fujian food was a little bit more on the tasteless side. Hey, hey, Amy, <laughs> boy, don't be coming to my ends, all right, and start chatting about our food. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not the food expert. Shady, if you look at the size of his left bicep, he knows what he's talking about, about the food. What do you think but of Fuzhou food? Fuzhou food, uh, and like our local food, is not about spicy at all. Okay. It's really spicy. So I'm wrong. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah. Right. So what is the typical feature of Fuzhou food? It 
like sweet. Oh, it's sweet. Yeah, sweet food. If you like sweet food, yeah, Fuzhou is a good location. <laughs> Sounds like you were like completely wrong. <laughs> <laughs> like three years has <laughs> meant <laughs> nothing. So, what's your favorite thing about Fuzhou? The spicy food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, right. Let's start that again. Yeah, the people. The people. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's better. Very sweet people. <laughs> so, I think it's about time I get my hands on some of that sweet, sweet Fuzhou food. We are here at a very local Fuzhou restaurant to get some local food. I hear that Fuzhou is very famous for their fish balls, so I'm very excited for the balls. <coughs> well, that's cool, isn't it? <laughs> On this table, what would be your favorite? Me? Yeah. Uh, definitely. Hey. The Liju Road. Yeah, that's probably so up sweet, there for me. The pork's so crispy, and it's cool because they make it with pineapple. Yeah. This is delicious. This is super sweet. Spicy, traditional. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh... So, this is the famous Fujo mash taro. Very curious. Mm. So sweet. It's like a sweet mashed potato. It's really, really good. Oh, your mouth. It's mad that. Oh, it's the fish balls. Here they go. We have three fish balls here. Full of excitement here. This is my first time ever trying a Fujo fish ball. It's a lot bigger than I was expecting, so it's one ball per person. So you can see that for scale. Mm. Oh, there's something on the inside. What is it on the inside? Pork. Pork. Okay, so it should be more like a fish pork ball. Yeah, um, yeah, I could eat five more of those. <laughs> well, look at us getting our little teas. <laughs> These are so awesome. Whoopsies, I just uh, knocked that off its little tray. Yeah. Go on, Shady. Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Uh. Okay, so this is definitely not the kind of building I'm expecting to see in the middle of China. What is it? Yeah, so guys, this area is called John Tinjie. Uh, the foreigners here call it the German uh, German Mall. Basically, as you can see, it's not very Chinese architecturally designed. Um, so yeah, it's just a pretty cool building that's uh, in the middle of a Chinese city. So it kind of reminds me of home oh, and uh, being back in Europe. I don't know if you can see in the daytime, all of these uh, little sh like shops and stalls, it's like a wholesaler's market. Cool. So you can buy anything from like a thousand Christmas trees to like a thousand backpacks. This guy here with the world's smallest uh, fishing rod. This guy isn't just controlling one fishing rod, he's actually got like four in different places along this bridge that he's just like maintaining. This river had the most gnarly whirlpools. Well, we didn't find a thousand Christmas trees, but we did find pantyhose, umbrellas, and a lot of red underwear. It's honestly the weirdest feeling. You get out of this like wholesale mall and then you've got all this crazy architecture here. It feels like in, I'm in like France or something, kind of, ish, maybe. But, but you know, it's a vibe. Can you rap? Rap? Yeah. It's pong sweaty, needs to be arms heavy. Let's pour me on sweat already. Mom's spaghetti is nervous. I don't know, sub hips come and ready to jump bomb. But the kick tone forgetting what he wrote down. The whole crowd goes so loud. He opens his mouth, but the words won't come out. He's choking, huh? Everybody's choking now. The crowd run now. Times are over, blow. That made my day. That was like the coolest freaking thing I've ever seen. I, told you, I'm a rapper. I can't think of a better way to end off today's video. Thank you guys so much for showing me around Fuzhou. Uh, and I'm sure there's a lot of other things you, you can do here, but I really enjoyed just like. Sorry. <laughs> Honestly, oh, call me. Oh, honestly, no way. What have we got to do no. to get an outro here? No. Everyone, remember to. Um, uh, do that, and, and, <laughs> do the YouTuber stuff, subscribe, travel with Teal, thanks. That's the one, yeah. that's the one. Thanks yeah. guys for watching and also, um, do you have like, are you on Spotify or like, are you on iTunes or like, can anyone check out your music or? No, sorry, I don't have any. <laughs> thanks guys, I'll uh, see you next time. Bye! Bye! -bye. Bye, -bye.